welcome back today. I hope you guys are having a lovely day. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to click that subscribe button. It is just below. And if you're ready to come back, hello, welcome back today. So today I'm going to show you guys really a really natural kind of makeup look, which is perfect for every day because sometimes I'm not one to kind of put on a load of makeup, but you sometimes have bad skin days and you want to look nicer than your bad skin day. So um, I'm going to show you with you guys a really easy, simple way to get kind of a natural makeup look kind of in seconds. So let's just jump into this video guys and show you how I do it. So first off, I am going to put some foundation on today. Yes, I don't use this all the time. However, my skin is not looking that great, not very even skin tone. So I'm just going to top it up with some NARS foundation. This is their Velvet Matte Foundation Stick. But I don't use a lot of it, so I'm just going to go. And then with clean hands, I'm just going to blend it in. And this is really going to help to keep a really natural kind of makeup look without going over the top. I'm not looking to cover it up completely because naturally we all have bad skin days but I'm just kind of giving myself that little bit of a better skin tone, better like complexion so that's all I'm using it for. I don't overgo like overdo it with um, foundation because I like to keep my skin quite natural because that is me at the end of the day. I've always done that and I think it's really good for your skin to breathe. So now moving on to eyebrows, I'm actually using NARS um, brow pencil However, there is so many out there that work really well. I might do a video of like the ones that I really use a lot because there is because there's so many out there that I jump to. But this one at the moment, I'm really enjoying. So there are my eyebrows done, very subtle, I'm not going over the top with them, it's just using the pencil slowly and then I try and do as little as possible here so it blends out quite nicely. So now moving on to my eyes, I'm going to use my black pencil liner in my top waterline. And the reason I'm doing this is because I find that it really opens up the eyes and makes them kind of more awake and I, I don't know I've always done this even on a natural makeup look. Now moving on to mascara I love using Maybelline um, Total Temptation. The great thing about this is it's, it doesn't like overextend your eyelashes so they look quite natural and um, it's got coconut oil in which is great for your eyelashes and it smells really good. So now I'm going to add a little bit of bronzer onto my cheeks to kind of make them like look a bit healthier, look a little bit like less dull. And I'm going in with um, Revolution, this is their bronzer. I have done a video about this, so I'll link it above and in the description box if you would like to see what I say about it. The great thing about this one, it's just, you don't have to build it, it's, it's great and subtle. So now finally I'm moving on to blushes just to give my cheeks a little bit more colour and this is Max Factor's Creme Path Blush in 15 Seductive Pink. So there you go guys, this is my kind of natural um, everyday makeup look. Really simple, um, it just gives your skin that little bit of glow without putting on too much makeup. I really like how it's opened up my eyes, sorted out my eyebrows and kind of given my skin that little bit extra sometimes i don't use foundation um because my skin's okay but i only use foundation if i find that my skin um tone is a bit all over the place and it just helps to kind of balance it out um what do you guys think of my kind of natural everyday makeup look is it something that you would go for or is it not kind of your cup of tea let me know in the comments and if you didn't like it did like it didn't like it did like it um don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't already guys click that subscribe button it is just below i hope you guys have a lovely day